So you might be trying to figure out how you can remove the Google search bar that's at the very bottom of your Android home screen. Now, there's a few ways to do this. The main way to do it, I'll show you in a second. Actually, I'll show you right now. The main way to do this is by downloading and installing another launcher on your phone. Because Google hasn't allowed you to pretty much remove this widget like they used to, the only way to go ahead and basically remove it from your phone is by using a different launcher. So in this case, you can download a you know phone launcher like Nova Launcher. I've used quite a bit before. There's also tons and tons of launchers out there. This one's good. This one's one that you, a lot of people use. So once you have it installed, what you can do is basically open it up like this, and you will see that you still have this little widget thing at the bottom. You can always hold it down, and I think you can go ahead and replace it. So you can click replace, and you can change it with a different type of search bar if you want to. You might even be able to remove it. But at that point, the Google search should be disabled. So that is now replaced with something like that. You can swipe up and still see all of your you know, applications and whatnot. And you could probably even delete this. I'm sure there's a way that you can go ahead and basically remove this from your main display as well. And that is it. I can click configure. And that's basically how you can kind of modify it like that. Now, you can see I swiped out of it and I'm back in my original home screen. The only way to go and remove this, there's no way you can re totally remove it from your home screen besides using a different launcher. But you can disable it. So you can see for me that when I tap on my Google search, it doesn't actually take me into the Google website. It takes me straight into my app info. The reason for this is because I've disabled Google for my phone. So to do this, what you can do is you can go and make your way over to your specific phone settings like this. You want to click on apps. You want to go and click on see all 93 apps, or whatever. And you want to find the Google application. So in this case, you can find Google right up here. And what you want to do is you just want to disable it. There should be a little disable button on the front. So as long as you don't use your Google application, what you can do is you can just, you know, now anytime somebody taps on this, you should be able to go straight into there. You'll still be able to use other Google products and whatnot. It's just the Google app's going to be disabled. So now every time you click on it, it's just going to take you straight into basically enabling the Google, you know, website thing right here. And that's that. If you want to enable it, you can enable it again. And now it'll take you right into, and now when you click on it, it'll take you into Google. But if you want to disable it, you can always disable it that way. So... That's pretty much covers it up. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button on me so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.